Hey guys, what are you here? Welcome back to Dream Mar Valley. So we just got Buzz. Just got him to do my uh, thingy. So now, go back in here. See if I can get Woody. I want Woody. Woody, I need you. I need you to come here too. Buddy, buddy, buddy. Woody, Woody, Woody. <laughs> Wow, hello there. Oh, that's such a terrible... Howdy, partner. So long, <gasps> partner. Oh, no. They did, they did him dirty with, the, with that voice. All right, I guess I can't. Maybe I have to do some uh, of Buzz's quests. But, well, let's forget about that for now. Go here, let's go here, let's go oh, here, let's go. hello. Okay, you'll be on the door, you'll find the majestic African savannah. And you'll only you can use a dream light to open it. Oh. Do it! Stupendous! You may now visit the world. Well, you run along now. Let's go! <laughs> Darling, you got a friend in me. You got a friend in me. <laughs> Girls? Hi. Oh, ready. Hello, Nala. I should have talked first. <gasps> oh, hi. Hi, I'm a Caillou, and you must be. Roar. Grr, roar. I think you're the only one that can roar around here. Grr, roar. Be afraid, be very huh? afraid. Was that supposed to scare me? <laughs> He sounded like Kasimba when he was a cub. Hey, I thought I sounded pretty... You could talk! Of course! And he can understand me. Ha! I guess that means you're really not gonna eat here. That means you're not gonna eat me? I was just trying to scare you off. I thought you were another hyena. There are hyenas around here? You see those eyes closing in the darkness all around us? There's a whole pack of them. They've been tracking me ever since since my mate Simba and I set out from the Pride Lands. Hmm, maybe I can help you get rid of them. Well, you can either do that or keep out of my way. It's up to you. My name's Nala, by the way. What are you doing out here? I'm trying to get a little rest. Simba's king of the Pride Lands and we needed a bit of a break from all the royal stuff. Goodness, puppies. You guys are loud. Obnoxious. Wow. <laughs> he wanted to show me more of the jungle where he grew up with his friends, Timon and Pumbaa. Uh -huh. We got separated not long ago, and I'm supposed to meet him in the jungle. But I don't want to lead a pack of angry hyenas right to him. Tell me more uh -huh. about the hyenas. The hyenas have been uh, mad at us ever since we forced them away from prime. There aren't many as. <laughs> <laughs> These puppies think they're so, like, so tough. <laughs> they're just, they like bark at the bigger dogs. It's so funny. <laughs> Wait, who? Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, the numbers were dwindling. There aren't as many as there were back when their leader Scar was here. But there are still enough of them to cause a lot of trouble. We need to throw them off our trail. What can I do to help? I can hold the hyenas off for a bit, but there are a lot of them. Aww. If there were some way to block the path so they can't follow us, that would help. There are a lot of thorn bushes around here. I'll bet the hyenas wouldn't want to get the entangled on those. Uh, they wouldn't. But now will we... How will we get them to the middle of the path? Aha! I bet my trusty watering can might be able to help us. 
You sure that's gonna work? You're just you're just gonna have to trust me on this one. If you can if you can if you can hold if you can hold out those hyenas, I'll plant some seeds for the thorns and water uh, them until they grow. Don't worry, it shouldn't take too it shouldn't take long. It's magic. I don't know what it is that is, but you can explain uh -huh. it later. I'll hold up the hyenas as long as I can. I just hope you know what you're doing. Thank you. Take out the dried thorn bushes. violence happening. <laughs> to the edge of the far side. That worked. Oh! The thorns are too dense for the hyenas to get through. We did it. Whoa, you just held off a whole pack of hyenas on your own. Can it? Can I start a Nala fan club? Now it's time to find Simba. That's pretty pathetic. Uh, can I start a Nala fan club? <laughs> uh, thanks, but I couldn't have done it without you. Huh. Now it's my turn to help you. You should stick close to me for a bit. Even without the hyenas, the jungle has its dangers. Hmm. I don't know where you fall fall on the food chain, but your teeth and claws aren't very sharp, and you look kind of squishy. <laughs> You've hardly got any fur. Is that normal for your species? Uh, uh, yep, I'm a human. Huh? A uh, human? A uh, human, huh? I've never seen seen any of you around the waterhole. Well, welcome. And like I said, stick close to me. <laughs> A lot of things in this jungle might want to turn you into a meal. Good to know. I'll watch out. Mm. Looks like we're not going anywhere fast. There's a huge dried up dried stump blocking our way into the jungle. Uh, don't worry, maybe another one of my world tools can remove that. Thank you. Clearly. Uh, I bought her first. I'm still looking around, just a tad bit. Okay, I think I'm good. Dog? Puppy, stop chewing on my glasses!
Oh my gosh. Anything around here that would want to eat you either. That's really maybe I can help you look for some. Uh, maybe we can help you look for some. Uh, that would be great. It's a pretty big jungle. I'll look around here. Why don't you look for some uh, some on the other side of the river river over there? I need to find some way to get across. Maybe I could knock over these logs. Hey, someone won't think I'm a hina out to get him like you did, right? I don't want another misunderstanding. If you aren't if you aren't a threat, he's fairly friendly. If he bears his teeth, just say Hakuna Matata. He'll know you're a friend. Okay, here goes nothing. Find a way to lower the log into the waterfall. Which one? What log? What, this thing here? log near the waterfall. Ew, bugs. Thank you. They're gonna be bugs, glowy bugs are okay, I guess. Simba! Damn, we're good. Anything I could pick up or anything I could do in each floor, you know? That's just coming back over here. <laughs> Akuna Tata, what a wonderful phrase. Akuna Tata, ain't no passing crazy. Needs no worries for the rest of your days. It's a problem free philosophy. Akuna Tata. <laughs> Oh, I think I scared Simba. I don't know what's way to say to calm down. Yes. Kunamatata! Huh? Did you say Kunamatata? Oh. Can you run to Mona Pumba? Actually, I'm a friend of Nala. She sent me to find you. Ha! Nala, I've been looking all over the jungle for her. She's waiting on the other side of the river. <laughs> uh, wow, thanks for the help. Any friend of Nala's is a friend of mine. Oh. And, uh, sorry about the roaring at you before. Mm. All these hyenas around, we can't be too careful. Hey, no worries. Be prepared. <laughs> Just don't. <laughs> hey, no worries. <laughs> he 
you certainly not too many boomers in Nada. Motto. I think you you'd get along pretty well with them. Why don't go why don't we go see Nala? She's right near the entrance to the jungle. Huh. Alright, let's go. So long. some help fending off that those hyenas well it looks like you've handled it just fine on your own are you okay yes but fighting off a pack of hyenas does make you work up quite an appetite I'm so hungry I could eat a whole zebra not a lot of zebras around here but don't worry I think I know just the thing. Though, I might need some help from Hokkaido to put it together. Wait, Simba, you better not be talking about... Trust me, I promise you you'll find them slimy yet satisfying. Hi! It's great being back here with Nala. Last time we didn't get to explore, them, explore yeah. much. I wanted I wanted to do something special for her. Show her what life was like for me with Simon and Pumbaa. Hmm. Yes, they are cute. I want to pet them. And a special occasion in the jungle always calls for grubs. Grubs? Wait, like bugs? As long as I don't need any. Ha <laughs> <laughs> You don't. But when you see how tasty they look, you'll change your hmm. mind. I I'll just need some help finding everything. Uh huh. There's some really slimy bugs that you can fish out of the river around here. There are some really colorful bugs just outside of the jungle, in the dried out oasis. Okay, I'll collect those while you get everything ready here. Bye! Time to go fishing! And oh, the shame! Stop changing my name! What's in a name? And I got downhearted every time that I. Ooh, but not another kid. Oh, sorry. <laughs> And craze mean the worries for the rest of your days. It's a problem free philosophy. Akuna Matata. Akuna Matata. Akuna Matata. Akuna Matata. Where? Oh, there it is. Let's get the colorful bugs. I would not touch those. <laughs> it's so gross. Kunamatada. What a wonderful phrase. Kunamatada. Gotta go through the cave. Yeah. Give them a bug so they can eat the bugs. I don't want to eat bugs. They're really gross. Hi. Great job, but I think this meal could use more crunch. There's some red bugs where where you found me earlier. You'll have to dig up the stump, so be careful. 
Once you've got the stumps out, the bugs will start running away. You'll have to be pretty fast to catch them. Thanks. Sure. Just give me more things to do. Okay, that's all right. Dig up the stumps. Dig up the dumps. Oh. Why are you lagging so hard? Oh my gosh, please. Aha! All these stupid uh, plants and stuff get out of my gosh dang way. Great. <sighs> okay, cool. Cook three using the red bugs. Okay, so cook where? It's a problem free. The last three. Cool, I'm tired. Yeah. I guess I just gotta get exit the world and do that, I guess. I don't know. Uh, I go through there. Let's go cook stuff now. I just saw it on a U and then on a U. That's over there. Right. 
Mustn't stay in the sun, dear. Terrible the complexion. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. But you can you need two color bugs and two. Head back to your... Okay. Okay. That's what that does. People talking is going to be pissing me off. Quit licking her. See how Let's see, okay, now two of these. Two of these. And then one of the one of the ones. There we go. Ugh. it out. Simba and get this freaking thing done. Do 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 do. Can you just go away? Girl, eat the bugs. Hi. These are grubs that. So these are the grubs that uh, Simba loves so much. <laughs> I have to admit, they do look kind of tasty. I must be really hungry. Well, here goes. Hmm. The taste is... Is it like chicken? Can't with a very pleasant... Is it like chicken? Uh, I'm not sure, but I can see how some started to like it after a while. Ooh. They're sort of crackly and squishy at the same time. Hey, did you hear that? Hear what? Shh, stay quiet and listen. I think it's more hyenas. I'm going to go check. I have a habit of adding or subtracting words sometimes. It's definitely hyenas. But this time it's not just a just a pack. Hmm. It's as many as a herd. I counted hundreds of them. Seven and I can handle ourselves against some some of them, but their numbers they're just too many. Gosh dang it, could you just uh -huh. We're completely surrounded. If only we had a herd of lions to fight them fight them off. <sighs> Nala, that's it! We may not have a herd, but we can trick them into thinking we do. Aww. How do we do that? We just need to make it sound like we have hundreds of lions in the jungle. I'm gonna sneak back to my village and try to find something. I'll talk to Mr. Mist Mel. I'll, I'll talk to Mr. Mertuck and uh, I'll bet he has something yeah. that would help. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> She's suddenly like a uh, fucking uh. British now. All right, Simba and I will try to hold back the hyenas, but please hurry. Goodbye. Oh, I could have just exited there. <sighs> Someone I hate is talking. It's pissing me off. All right, Mr. McDuck, oh, I need greetings, you. Neighbor. Hi, you need what? You need what exactly? I need something to scare a whole lot of hyenas. Maybe some sort of hyena repellent spray. You don't happen to know where I can find a herd of lions, do you? Hyena repellent? We don't get many hyenas in the valley, so it wouldn't make my, my sense to stock that. Okay, so maybe a spray is practical, but what about something to make a lot of noise to scare them off? 
If I could just turn the sound of two lines roaring into the sound of a hundred lines roaring. Oh. oh, well, why did you say it from the start? I've got a, an old sound system in the basement of my shop. I think I used to, I used to belong to someone goofy new. <laughs> it's in a rough shape, but with a few repairs, it ought to be it ought to do the trick. With that, I could with that I could amplify the sound of a couple of lines uh, roaring, so it fills the whole jungle. Thanks, Mr. Murdock. I'll do some repairs and take this back to Nala. Bye bye. Woo! All right. So I need two iron ingrates. Iron ingots, ingrats, and sauts. Ingots. At least I got everything else. That's good. <laughs> Alright, return to the kingdom. Woohoo! right up my fucking chest. What are you doing? What are you doing? I'll just go to sleep now. Okay, now. What she gets? Yeah, I know, but. <laughs> well, yeah, you're gonna have the reaction when something bites you. But they need to learn not to do that. <laughs> uh, finally, you fucking leaves. God fucking damn it. Hi. <gasps> Anyways, what's this? It's a sound system. I'll get the speakers set up. Just think of it as a really big noisemaker. If you insert a roar into the microphone as loud as you can, the noise will fill the whole jungle. Those behind us will think we've got many, uh, we've got an army of lions on our side. That should take, that should scare them away. Oh! Oh, let me. Things away. I guess it's worth a try. Say, can humans roar? If you roared with this, it would make it even louder. I guess I could mm -hmm. try. Come on, let me hear you roar. <laughs> and not like that pitiful one you did when we first met. Really go for it. Uh, grr. Roar. <gasps> roar! <laughs> not too bad, okay, you? No, maybe if you've got a little line in you after all. I'll get the sound system set up. It's now or never. <laughs> There's no way it does that, but you know. Woo! Hey! <laughs> I can't believe that actually worked! <laughs> the highness cleared out as soon as they heard the sound of the roaring. Yeah! I'm impressed with Caillou. Mm. And you've definitely made me curious about this place you come from. Um, oh, hi. Why don't you come and find out? It's called Jerma Valley. The villagers there are like my pride. No. There are lots of things. No. Everything the light touches there is mine. <laughs> the light villagers are there are like my pride. Well, after how much you've helped us, I'd love to meet your pride. Though I do have one question. Do you have any food besides grubs? Yeah, We've got lots of food. Zebra? Afraid not. Antelope? Sorry, none of that <gasps> either. Hippo? What do you have? Why don't you come visit and find out? 
Is there a place for lions to sleep? Good point. I'll get one set up for you. Then Simba, then Simba, then Simba and I will come visit as soon as as soon as it's ready. Thank you. You're welcome. And I'm definitely gonna put them in the sun up toe. Well, what do you know? I'm here. <laughs> well, I'm here. First of all, how big is the thing? Oh my gosh, it's huge. <laughs> on. Uh, maybe if I can find. Put the next to the watering hole. Maybe, uh. Can I get rid of this? Move. Hey. Or maybe I can. No, not there. No, not there either. Maybe like right there. Yeah, okay. Put this by the other one. <laughs> Move that. I like over here. Move this big guy. Maybe like over here. Can I move these? Oh, I can! What the frick? Okay. Oops. Um. Oh, jeez. Oh, my gosh. Why? Oh, dear. Why? Oh, no. Stop. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Right here. And boom! Oh, greetings, ah, neighbor! Great. Did you know that Pred Rock is the traditional home of the lions in the valley? Unfortunately, the fruit getting left the place overgrown and in a start state. Oh. <laughs> but don't fret, I can clear out anything dangerous. For a modest fee, of course. Just Whoa. do it. I mean, I got over a million, so. Good! Sparkling me spats! Sparkling me spats? Uh, when I'm done with this place, it'll be fit for a king. Place. It's beautiful. Say, where's Simba? He said he'd come meet us soon. He wanted some time alone. Uh, the fight with the hyenas. I think it brought back some old, old memories about his father. Speaking of old memories, I think I've been here before. You used to live here, Nala, back before the forgetting. It might take a while for your memories to come back. Just try to take it slow. This is amazing. I can't believe I ever forgot about this place. It already feels like I have friends here. I hope Simma com comes to join we us soon. We are so lucky to have you here! Anna! Me and the lion are trying to have a conversation. How about you not throw your voice over our conversation? <sighs> I'll go talk to him. For now, you uh, you just enjoy the village. You can explore the valley, you can find something to eat. You, you can start, you can, uh, you can start meeting many of the other villagers. I'd really like that. One, one can never have too many friends. Uh, there's just one thing I have to warn you about. Watch out for Scar. <laughs> Scar is here? That's... How is that possible? I watched him fall from Pride Rock and... He can't have survived. Pretty, oh, well, speaking speaking of... <laughs> Scar's not so bad. I've got him well trained. He's pretty cunning. Anything is possible. Jimmy Valley. The rules here, they're pretty different from anywhere else. Maybe this isn't quite the Scar you remember. Oh, I guess there's a lot I don't understand about this place yet. Don't worry, I'll keep it. I'll, I'll keep an eye on Scar. He better not try anything, or I'll put a stop to it. All right. All right, quest time. Okay, talk to Buzz in the village. Talk to Simba. Let's talk to Buzz. Actually, let's um. Let's talk to 
to... Let's talk to him. Oh, I'll be back. <laughs> Simba. Simba. Remember who you are. Hey, buddy. Hi. Hey, Okayu. Hi, Okayu. Uh, well, tell me something that was something about bothering you. Oh, yeah. I guess it is. Everything that happened with the hyenas. Well, it just brought back a lot of me memories, and now I'm feeling a little lost. <laughs> My friend Rafiki likes to tap me on the head with his walking stick when I get like this, just to knock some sense into me. <sighs> oh, ah! I wish you were here to do that now. Anything I can do to help? I'm good with her, you know? Huh. You've, hel you've helped a lot already. Uh -huh. But I don't know if you're going to be able to help help with this. <sighs> I just keep thinking about my father, Mufasa. Huh. I'm pretty new at being king. There are so many decisions, so much is at stake. Mm. I wish my father were here to help me and give me advice. Oh, I'm sorry, Simba. I wish I could do something. Maybe I can give you advice. I'm, a, I'm sorry, Simba. Uh, he told me something once. Uh -huh. Something about... Hey, why don't I just show you? Follow me. Thanks. I would follow you anywhere. Go on. There you go. Pitter patter, pitter patter, pitter patter, pitter patter, pitter patter. Hi! Now it's on. My father told me that the great kings of the past looked down from some stars. I believe it. There's something magical about that stars. Actually, there are balls of gas burning miles and miles away. I hear there are fireflies that got stuck up there. I believe it. There's something magical about the bad stars. When I look up at them, I know my father is right. <laughs> it's nice to think that those those who came before me, before, are always up there guiding us. <sighs> if I could, if I could just see them, I know what I, I know, I'd know what to do. But I can't. Look, there's too many clouds. <sighs> I haven't been able to see the stars for a few nights now. Every time I look up at them, it's cloudy. Wait, how long has it been, has this been happening? <sighs> I don't think about it. I can't remember the last time I saw the stars. That's pretty weird. I remember if something. I I don't. I wonder if something magical is how going on. Huh? What do you mean? Uh, no worries. Uh, this might be this might be a tough bit tough to explain, but I think I know somebody who might be able to help. I'll go talk to Merlin and see if he knows what to what might be going on. See ya. See ya. We got a situation! Oh, the baby's asleep. Merlin, do 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 do. Merlin. Merlin, Merlin, Merlin. Merlin, Merlin, Merlin. Do 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 do, Merlin. Real quick. Is he still in his thingy? Is he still there? Yes, he's still there. I am Buzz Lightyear. So this is... Yeah. <gasps> Why are you enormous? I'm not enormous, you're just toy-sized. Yes, because I'm a... Mm -hmm. Wait, you're not a toy. I'm breaking toy world number one. I was supposed to drop to the ground and pretend to be an enemy. I don't think toys need to be... need to do that here in Tree My Valley. The line between what's a toy and what's not a toy, and what's real and what's pretend... Well, it's all a little fuzzy <laughs> here. Hmm. Well, uh, I, gu I guess I'll have to take your uh, word for it. But, yep, you know, uh -huh. it's the strangest thing. Now that I'm in, now that I'm here, the valley seems <laughs> familiar. Woody and I, we've been here before, mm -hmm. haven't we? This place, 
this uh, was a place where no toy went un unloved, and everyone had a purpose. Don't worry, all your memories what should start to come back soon. I hope so. This is unsettling. <laughs> For now, I'll do some surveillance and see if I can get it reacquainted. Great, I'll go see Woody and we'll keep working on Bonnie's farm. You've got style, my friend. You got a friend in me. You got a friend in me. Let's talk to Merlin. Merlin, where are you, buddy? Right there. Bye, Scar. Bye, Scar. <laughs> Yay! Meeting me halfway. Thank well, you. hello. Hmm. I get the peculiar. I get the peculiar feeling you stumbled upon yet another magical mystery. Oh, quite you? miraculous. And considering you where you've been, I surmise it involves lions. Well, uh, have I surmised correctly? You nailed Extraordinary. it! Extraordinary! Haha, do tell me more! I passed through the door in the castle and found myself in a new realm, somewhere in a jungle. I met Simba there, but he won't come back to Jerma Valley unless I can help him see the stars. He wants us to get some gut he wants to get some guidance from the great kings of the past. That should prove to be. That should be proved to be. That shouldn't prove to be too. Why? That shouldn't prove to be too difficult. There is almost nothing as constant as uh, that stars. Simply wait for night, and then, well, look up. That's that's the problem. Simba can't even, even remember the last time he saw the stars. It's always cloudy. I think something strange is going on. Possibly something what? magical. <laughs> that is a bit odd. I suspect I know the explanation. Well. The realms that you visit are the worlds of, are the wor are worlds the villagers created when they needed to escape Dreamman Valley. Like slipping into a dream of some place you once knew long ago. Oh. The realms are tied to their memories and their feelings. It's possible that the sky in Simba's realm is clouded precisely because his memories of his father are clouded with uncertainty. Uh so how do I help him? Simba will need some magical aid and some help with his troubles. You'll have to start by creating some sort of object to channel the spell. So then it holds some meaning to uh, Simba. Hmm, but what kind of object would hold meaning for a lion? A cat toy? Maybe a platter of full of grubs? Something from his past? Yes, precisely. Wait, I got it! Simba mentioned something bopping him over the head with a walking stick to knock some sense into Delightful! <laughs> uh, that sounds, like, that sounds precisely like what, what you'll need. Just a sight of it might be enough. Next, you'll need to infuse it with purified nitrogen, uh -oh. which thankfully I gathered quite a bit. <laughs> Once you've done that, find the point of the, in the jungle near the nearest the sky, point the walking stick towards the clouds, and command them to part. Do We're I playing... smell rosemary? Mm. Anyways, if we're, we're playing Moses here, are we just no, with the with the sky, not the water? Uh, be careful, though. This is a dangerous magic. You'll be influencing the very fabric of reality in the realm. It'll be worth it to help. Where it'll be worth it to help Simba. <laughs> Off with you now. <laughs> lots to do, lots to do. Speaking of night shards. You got a friend in me. You got a friend in me. Wobbla wobbla wa. Freaking Randy Newman. Alright, there we go. Oh, wait, no, wait, no, wait. Return to the Lion King realm. Will do, my dude. There was a button. There was a gosh dang button that I could just pop up the... I don't remember what it was. <laughs> no, that's not it. What is that, though? What's that? What's that? Oh. Which button was it? Oh well. Uh, oh wait, no, there he 
here. <laughs> I'm like, wait, huh? I don't know what I'm doing anymore. You got a friend in me. Alright, let's go back to Sim. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Sim. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Wubble 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 wubble. Oh, it's the log. Makuna, Matata, Makuna, Matata, Makuna, Matata, Makuna. It means no worries for the rest of your days. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> That's where he went from kitten to uh, cub to lion. Hi. I've got something to show you, Simba. Here. Uh, uh, that, look, that looks just like Rafika's walking stick. <laughs> <laughs> You're not gonna bop me on the head with it, are you? Only if you want me to. <laughs> That's okay. I'm not really looking for a headache today. Merlin told me that to cast a spell, I need to start to start by finding something to remind you of the past. Hmm. Well, that definitely works. Just looking at that thing makes me think of all the things Rafi Rafiki told me. What? Uh, then I think it's then I think it's time for the next part of the enchantment. Stand back. This is gonna take a lot of dreamland magic to cast. Merlin says it might be dangerous. I don't think we'll be able to try this twice if it goes wrong. See ya. Okay. Hi. Okay, you. I think something's starting to happen. I feel the wind picking up. I could, I could really help to make sure that the weather's sunny when we hunt gazelle. I don't think it works that way, and, and besides, all that magic really took it out of me. I wouldn't want to try that again. Ah, oh, thanks for doing it all. Just looking at the stars, I really already feel closer to the great kings of the past. Well, do they have any guidance for you? It's funny. Now that you mention it, I just remember something my father used to tell me about the about being a good leader. He said that good leaders love leave their kingdom better than it was at the start of their reign. It sounds like your father was very wise. Leave the leave the kingdom better, hmm? How could we do that? Uh, we could clean up the dried oasis. We could build a giant water slide. We could open. We could huh. the one right outside the jungle. Whoa. That's a great idea. And just the kind of thing my father meant. Why don't we go look at that oasis now and see how we can clean it up? So long. No, you know what? Follow me, because you're just gonna... to be a water hole for all the animals in the jungle. <sighs> but it looks like it's been dried out for quite a while now. Hmm. It looks like it needs some water. <sighs> yeah, if there used to be water here, then there must be a way to bring it back. Hmm. I'll try to figure out that I'll try to figure that part out. Maybe you could find some plants. <sighs> if there were plants here, that would bring back a lot of the smaller animals. Oh and they would bring back bigger ants. Hey! hey! Circle of life. Uh, what sort of plants should I get? Where can I find them? Hmm. 
you sh could check some of the uh, those jungle farms near the river. Rafika said plants from the plants come from seeds, so maybe you could get some seeds from those. Uh huh. Oh, and there's a plant near one of the waterfalls that might have some hmm. too. And there are trees in a clearing where you found me, and I bet those have uh... some seeds. Uh, but you might need to do some digging to get to get them. Do you think your paws could do that? Who needs paws when you've got a royal shovel? That ought to do the trick. Thanks. You're welcome. Cool, tada. What a wonderful phrase. Oh, okay, I see. I think that's clear. That one, clearing tree seed. Kuna Matata, what a wonderful phrase. Perfect! Alright, bring them back to the oasis. Which kind of makes me think of Onus Oasis! 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 <laughs> I don't know what the deal is with the word oasis, but it's apparently they find it funny. I love those two. Ethan's adorable and Mark is just oh, the dreamiest. Oh, he's so dreamy. Hey, good to see you. He found seeds. That's great. Uh -huh. Now we just need to plant them around the set with the oasis. Sounds good. And with a few drops from my watering can, they'll grow in no time. Don't worry about watering them yet. If the plants are going to survive, we'll need to bring all the water back from the oasis. <laughs> I think I've almost got that part figured out. Why don't you plant the seeds and come find me? See ya. This 
one will be... This one will be right here, how about that? Hey there! Looks like you planted all the seeds, and I'm pretty sure I figured out how to bring the water back. There's a river that used to run through here. It fed the oasis and kept the plants alive. Hmm. But the river is blocked. Looks like there's some... Looks like there's some kind of mudslide. Huh. But I've been trying to dig it out with my paws, but there's... A giant rock block in the flow of the water. Maybe if I can use my pickaxe to break... We could get the water flowing again. Huh. Really think you could break that rock? That would be great. Thanks. I could do anything. I'm the main character. Sorry. <laughs> Which rock? The oh, that thing. Hey, good to see ya. Wow, looks better already. And this is just a start. Once the animals come back, it, it'll look even nicer. This will help the whole jungle. Your dad will be proud. Your dad will be pr proud. I hope so. Thanks, Okayu. I feel like my father's looking down at all of us right now. Maybe I can be a, a king worthy of him. I didn't know him, but I bet you're right. Hey, since we've helped the, ki helped the kingdom, why don't you come back... Come with me and meet Nala. Uh, she's waiting for you in my kingdom, Jirima Valley. I could use some someone there to teach me to how to be a good girl. We need your roaring personality. It's a great place for who could. It's a great place for who could Matata. Really? Cause after fighting off hyenas and fixing the oasis, I could use a little who <laughs> could Matata. We've already got a place for you in the village. Nala's waiting. Nala's waiting there for uh, <laughs> now. I love to go. Lead the way. See ya. Return to Dreamlight Valley. All right. <laughs> Welcome, Simba. <laughs> Akuna Matata. This place really this place really is all you said it was. Uh... Everything is here is your kingdom. Everything life touches, not just my kingdom, we all share it. Well, except for the parts, you know, not, not just my kingdom, we all share it. That's a good perspective for a ruler to have. I think we're going to learn a lot from each other. Huh. I'm going to go find Nala. I can't wait for us to explore this place together. Simba, wait, there's one thing I have to warn you about. Watch out for Scar. <laughs> Scar? He's here? But how? That can't be possible. After uh. everything he did to my family. I'll keep Scar in line. Don't worry, maybe you can help me handle him. It'll be okay. I'll keep. I'll help keep Scar in line. So if Scar seems seems too lazy or tries anything, or too. So so far, as Scar seems too lazy to try anything. I've got him on a pretty short leash. <sighs> That's good. But still, I think I'll keep clear of him. There are just a lot of bad memories. Huh. Thanks for warning me, Okayu. I'm gonna find. I'm gonna find Nala. Congratulations. Huh, well, look at that. Well, I got Nala, I got Simba, and I got Woody. I just still need to get Buzz, but well, I think this is a good um, <laughs> this is a good spot to end it because I'm running over a little bit an hour. So <gasps> I hope you guys enjoyed. I know I did. Um, and you guys, I'll catch you on another episode. Bye bye for now.